Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Through this video, you can note down the question and answers of class 7th geography lesson 1, environment. So let's begin. Question 1 is, what is an ecosystem? So the relationship between living organisms as well as their surroundings and other organisms is called an ecosystem. For example, a forest has a different ecosystem. Your home has a different ecosystem. Any lake, any pond, forests of Amazon and forests of India have a different ecosystem because they all, the all creatures depends on uh, their surroundings as well as animals and plants and insects of their surroundings. What do you mean by natural environment? Natural environment includes land, water, air, plants, animals, anything that is given by nature. What are the four major domains of the earth? So lithosphere, atmosphere, hydrosphere, biosphere. They are the four major domains. Lithosphere means the solid crust of the earth. Atmosphere is the layer surrounding the earth, layer of air surrounding the earth. Hydrosphere includes the all the water bodies and biosphere includes the living components, all the living organisms. Then fourth question, natural environment, it's of, we have to classify natural environment. So it's of two types, biotic and abiotic. Biotic means the living environment and abiotic means the non-living environment. Then what are the major components of environment? So there are three major components of environment. Natural environment, human environment, and human-made environment. Natural environment includes lithosphere, atmosphere, biosphere, hydrosphere. That means basically natural, these are the four domains of the earth and as well as they are part of natural environment. Then human environment includes individual, family, community, religion, etc. And human-made environment includes anything created by individuals, the material things. So like buildings, bridges, cars, industries. So human environment is basically that environment with which humans interact with. It is not a thing. It is not material thing. What is lithosphere? So it is the solid crust of the earth, hard top layer of the earth. And it is made up of rocks and minerals. And lithosphere can take various shapes. It can be in the form of mountain, plateaus, plains, valleys. What is biosphere? Biosphere includes the plant and animal kingdom. It is that living world. Then we have hydrosphere. The domain of water is called as hydrosphere. That means any water body is called hydrosphere. What is atmosphere? It is the thin layer of air that surrounds the earth and you have to write its features. It is a five marker question and it is very important. So gravitational force of the earth holds the atmosphere around it and it protects us from the harmful rays of the sun. It consists of number of gases, dust and water vapor. It provides us with breathing air and the changes in atmosphere produces changes in weather and climate. The ozone layer that you might have heard about, it is also part of atmosphere. And atmosphere has five layers about which we'll read in uh, later chapters of geography. Then you have to define human environment, human made environment and barter system. So this we have discussed already and barter system, it is the exchange of goods, goods for goods, like there is no money. So in previous times when there was no money, people used to exchange goods. That means if I want rice and you have rice and you want wheat and I have wheat, so we both will exchange. Then when is the Earth Day observed? On 22nd of April and on 5th of June, World Environment Day is observed. Then there's an activity. Draw a diagram showing the components of environment. It is given in your book. So make it on a pastel sheet and paste it in your notebook and color it as well. So that's it everyone. Thank you so much.